Here are some good examples of um, coasts that have been modified by biogenic um, processes. We've got marine organisms, in this case plants. Mangrove trees up in the top left corner are um, very commonly referred to uh, when we're talking about secondary coasts because mango trees can actually extend the coastline because they can grow into water. So uh, they've got their roots directly in uh, water and they can extend the coast and grow out as they kind of grow on top of each other over a, a long period of time. They create a very large um, stable sort of net that sediment gets trapped in and uh, deposition occurs and then they continue to move out over the water edge. So mangrove trees and mangrove coast is, is very common, especially in Florida. Um, this is an example in the bottom right of a saltwater marsh. Uh, if you've ever been out mudding or oystering, you'll uh, be pretty familiar with this. Uh, and this coast is again caused by uh, this marsh grass that, that grows and secures sediment, um, these mud flats here, and um, uh, shapes the coast by the location of the, uh, the, the salt marsh.